Hi guys, finally I'm here. Hi Evan, hi Bradley, how you doing? Welcome to the stream. I'm just doing the link, so we'll be with you in a second. And there's the old uh, biddy 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 biddy, um, biddy biddy biddy, no that's, uh, that's Buck Rogers that one, that's BB-8 that one. Right, we are here. We're on the main menu because I've only just managed to um, log in. No, Facebook, I don't want to add a button. Sod off. Just post the bloody post. Uh, right, let's upset people in my Discord server. Why is my Discord server not on? Um, uh, b -b 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 links. Changing world links. No. Uh, where are we? Stream links, there we go. Right. Du, 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 du. Go. I'm also in the back cave, guys, as well. Um, right, let's start off, and we're starting off on us um, SPG. Right, let's do the. Um, what did I just shut down Internet Explorer? There we go. Uh, monetization. And I think we're all done. Uh, I said Sam Patch, didn't I? So we are on the way down to Sam Patch. Uh, save on that. I just need to go to channel content. It should come up. Yep. Okie dokie. So, chuck us a like. Chuck us a... Uh, um, I've done it again. Why have you done that? Right, so who have we got? We've got Josh. Hi, Josh. Hi, Arsenal. Hi, Darko. Hi, Alex. Hi, Flipper. Bradley and Josh. Yeah, hi, guys. Um, right, so just do the... Uh, I'm just checking that's right. That was spelled it right. Yep, that's done. And we'll get that all oh, that's pinned up the top. Jack will be here in a bit. Right, okay, so we're on Sun Patch. Sun Patch. And the one we're doing tonight, I think it's uh, Y107. So how are we all doing? Um, yeah, thanks, BB-8. So this is where AJ, just like, he doesn't go to the streams. He just hangs out. And just chats all the time on the thing, even though he, he can't, you know, he can't watch. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Right, so we're doing Y107, pick up and set out. I am in the back cave, guys. Right, okay, so come on, yes, I368 has set out cars, picked them up and set them out in the bowl so we can sort them out later. Then get their shipment pushed over to them. Let's get them back on the road 40 minutes. It might be a little bit longer than that. Because it's absolutely whizzing it down with rain. Uh, just get everything set up. Hope you all had a good couple of days. Bright lights. House on the hill. 
Um, yeah, Alex, it'd be interesting to see what they have got over the next couple of weeks. Um, what we've, uh, come on. What, uh, what routes are, um, inbound, but, yeah. I've got a feeling that's going to be wrong. You're hearing notifications from the, um, I'll put them on, from the, uh, from Discord as well. Hi John, Josh Grant, sorry, oh there you are, sorry you are back. CNF branch would, would be nice to add on but I can't really see that happening to be honest. Oh, I think we've got a far, we've got a fair way to go. Um. Yeah, we do have a little way to go. This back. Are you JC? Oh, if there's anyone that's getting butt hurt because I'm not blowing a horn and everything, as you're supposed to, just don't bother saying, all right? We're not going down that road. Oh, possibly. Rapid transit, I'm not like Narrage, Norwich, Narrage? With Narrage. Yeah, I think, to be honest, we'd all like our own local lines, really, wouldn't we? Because we know how they all work. We know their quirks and everything. I think I've done that wrong already. Take the brakes off, that might help. Norwich. Norwich, ah yes, Norwich. A wee bit fast. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I've been on the train for about two years now. I think the last time was two thousand and nineteen when I did my last run to Eastleigh. I don't envisage probably going on one this year. I'd like to, but I just can't see it for the for time being. Yeah, but you know you still got to you still got to be careful. They'll put a lot of restrictions on what we can do. I mean, it's like I'd like to have the big meet up with everyone this year at Reading, but I really can't see it happening. Like I said, it's it's just too much, um, too many idiots about to, that's preventing it.
Oh, okay. Oh yeah, well I remember. Motion blur still on. Right, so I'll be flashing in and out of the map. From time to time. September, August, when it will be all out of the way. I don't think, no. I don't think it will be out of the way this year. This year. I think next year it will be. It will start to die down a lot towards the end of this year. But I think next year it will be eventually okay. Hi, Mancuni and Red, how you doing? I'm still going the right way, aren't I? Yes. Now, hopefully, most of the country will be vaccinated by September, October, November this year. Slow down just a wee bit more so I get just enough time to make a point change. Yeah, she's okay. She's um, she's cold because of the weather down here we're, we're about minus two it's not a lot but it's a wind chill factor of down to about minus five six sometimes so the house isn't warming up properly right let's make sure that's okay That seems all right. Speed her up a bit. Let's get back in cab. Oh. Let's see where we're going now. But well, that's not very helpful, is it? Oh, that reminds me. banking come on hi Adam Ripper. doesn't mean anything really to be honest half term for me I'm still working I didn't I, I was furloughed through the first lockdown worked through the little second mini lockdown and I'm working through this lockdown um, I've got idiots around me at work, like I said previously in certain streams about about people not believing it or whatever, um, and it kind of annoys me, but I can't do much about it apart from telling them to stay away from me. But they just think it's a big joke, and then they give you a 25-minute lecture on how it's not real, and if you watch it on the internet, go to YouTube, he can provide me with links and all that, and I'm just like, not interested. Doesn't, you know... Anyone can say anything on YouTube, but it means shit. I think, um... It's three degrees. 
so it's the highest it's been all day. Actually, where I am here. Oh! No, nothing at all to do with me, those. Right, let's just check the map. Where are we off to? I don't want to be off road. What do you mean our place gets the best weather? I would call this best weather. Hi, William. Yeah, I do have southeastern high speed, and it's what's on next. Yeah, same as the mission, yeah. Those tanks, they do kind of stand out quite well, actually, don't they? Right, speed up a bit. We haven't had really any snow, to be honest. We had a bit overnight. It was just like someone just got a, a little bit of flour and shoved it over the floor. That was it, really. That's what we get down there. The rest of the country has to get it really bad for us to get it. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's still quite cold here. Um, so, I mean, the central heat's on tonight. And I've got to keep the central heating on because of my mum, because of, because of her arthritis and everything. So, yeah. When you get arthritis, the cold is not your friend. Stop at location. Let's get us stuck on here. Um, where's the map? Let's have a look at the map. Map, 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 map. Um, keep an eye out on trains that are coming through as well. We're okay there, we're okay there. It's that one we got to go down. And we're in that one. Okay. Take the brakes off. Right, so if you're enjoying the stream, Leave us a like, sub to this channel, the street, the channel. Um, yeah, uh, do the usual, the absolute usual. William, do you have South Eastern high speed? If, if so, what do you think of it? Personally speaking, I love it.
Um, they've got to finish the optimization, and that will probably be a part of a core after a core update. So we might not get it for a while, to be honest. Yeah, this is why I'm doing sand patch, to be honest, because um, it is, I didn't expect, I wasn't expecting it to be good. I thought it was like a little bit boring. Uh, but since, I know it sounds really stupid, but I, I don't want the wiper, you donut, I want the door. Let me out the door. But since I've done the old, painted me old wagons, and, um, you know, it adds a little bit more colour variety, to the um to the consist instead of you know in there look you've got cp rail you've got um freight box which is or freight box yeah which is grand theft auto um then you've got a couple of csx wagons and there's even put ron in your tank there's going to be a couple more wagons done so they'll all appear up in in the thingies Sorry, I've got to look. I've got. I have to look. I need to know. Are they CSX? I think they're both CSX, aren't they? Oh, that's a shame. That's a shame. They're both CSX, but it's a. It's a nice long train. That's what I like on Sandpatch Grade. You could just be shunting down here and you still see loads of trains going through. Um, so where are we off to? Um, we're not paying attention. Um, yeah, we're okay there. We're just back to there again. Right, okay. Put it in reverse. Take the brakes off. Open the windows. Yeah, it's an ongoing thing with the layers of Augsburg. I think a lot of people have grown impatient about it, but I mean, I on the PS4 Pro, I did manage to run it. It was a little bit less frame rate, but to be honest, it didn't bother me. Um, yeah, I'm okay. Um, I've just been tired today. Um, it's just been a long week. And, um, well, it's been a normal seven-day week, but it's just been... A long hard graph this week uh, to be honest come on Well, most of the German ones, but the transit. I like the East Coast way. I like the um, Great Western Express, Warm Towns, Pan ITs Valley. I like a lot of them, the majority of them. Not overly keen on rapid transit or West Somerset Railway. Oh, 
Yeah, I mean, East Coast Way, you've got, you've just got the 377 and the 66 to drive, really. It's kind of hard sometimes if you drive, like, you do the commuter run with the 375 on Southeast High Speed, can you justify doing a 377 run on East Coast Way? in the same like stream sort of thing. What do I not enjoy about rapid transit? I don't know, I just... I think to be honest, it was just at the point where it, all it was you had the, um, the BR442 talent. And um, you didn't really have anything else, and then they brought the BR182 out, and I just by then I'd already like lost lost faith in doing it. I think, oh, this is gonna hurt. Oh, that's a rear ender, isn't it? I think I'll be able to get that coupled or not. There's no problem with it. Oh, yeah, Southampton train spot, mate. How you doing? What are the routes that you like, to be honest? Oh, you've got to be inside to do this all right. Oh, you're doing a multi drop on OTR. Yeah, so I'll be doing a few tests on OTR tomorrow to make sure that it's okay for me to play uh, because of problems with being motion sickness or having motion sickness for it. I think it was just the fact that I was actually outside of the cab, and obviously the cab, the cab was swaying a lot. I'm good, I'm tired. Always tired, me. But good. So, tomorrow, if everything okay goes well with the um, uh, the running the few tests I'll do on OTR then basically um, I'll be streaming it on Friday yeah, Western Express is a good route and I'm looking forward to, you know I, I like I like running it but I just feel it was it's a bit late now because they're providing a bit of DLC with it and even then, it's nice that they're providing DLC. It's a half-assed attempt because you have the um, the BR Blue. I mean, apparently they're going to be doing some sort of news release about it this week, I think. So uh, yeah, okay. I was looking at the the release stream for the uh, train sim uh, Dresden to Riesa 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 route in Germany, and it does look quite nice. It really does look nice. And I was thinking I was so tempted to buy it, and I thought, nah, I can't. I just bought on the road. I can't justify another twenty-five quid. No, I'm not doing that. I'm not doing that. Oh, easy. 
actually, can we do this? I know I probably shouldn't. I do see some trains running by with the uh, with the doors open on them. Right, take the brakes off. See, there's there's the point. See, there's so there's some people that don't like it, and there's some people that do like him. Hi, Jack. How you doing, mate? Good to see you come in, mate. Sorry. So what was it you actually went out to see? I'm off route. Sod it. I'm off route. I'm off route. Oh, you got you were working. I'm even getting XP for going backwards. <laughs> Yeah, that'll probably be uh, about 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock tomorrow then. I think we've got to push that all the way down, haven't we? Make sure... It's a dodgy little area. Going on Call of Duty. Oh, cool. I might be on it tomorrow night, um, or it might be during the week. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to finish the season pass, so I'm not overly bothered about it this year. I don't think it's as good as modern, what Modern Warfare was, to be honest. There's a nice couple of innovations in the multiplayer, but that's about it. Black Ops 3. I thought Black Ops 3 was rubbish, to be honest. Hi, Worthing fan, how you doing? Run to the stream. Hold on, Black Ops 3, was this the one where they had they had no game to it? It was just multiplayer. It was no um no campaign. Because that was awful. That was Black Ops 4, wasn't it? Black Ops 3 was the all the bionics and they're jumping around and all that crap. Didn't like that. I thought it said stop at location. Or was it go via location? 
Oh well, a bit late now. It should be the same way as we went out. Yeah, it will be. Right, okay. Hi Len, good evening, how are you sir? Advanced Warfare, it was a load of rubbish. All this jumping around, jumping off walls, jumping off ceilings, that's nah, just rubbish. Campaign wasn't too bad, but I just, you know, all the all the kids loved it, or a lot of the kids loved it. Yeah, it's the next best thing. It's like, really? That was another thing that put me off. And it just shows that they've got no imagination because they've released... The, the World War II one wasn't good. Cod Ghosts was okay. That was an original one. The World War II one, which was the last one that they did before this Modern Warfare remake, just goes to show that they've got no original content ideas, to be honest. It's kind of a prequel to Modern Warfare, but it isn't. Well, is it or isn't it? You know what I mean? One in space is crap. Yeah, that had Lewis Hamilton in it as well. <laughs> That's funny. I did enjoy the storyline on that. And that was released when I had the, the VR headset as well. The PlayStation. Yeah, the VR mission wasn't too bad, but Star Wars Battlefront was so much better. I have to say the best CODs for me were Modern Warfare 1 or Modern Warfare 2. 1.2 miles down there. I want to make sure that I am actually doing this right. So that should be right because we're going. Right, yes. That's not I don't think that it's just... And then we just cut this is why I had a problem with this because I actually derailed it. So how many trains we got here? Oh that's the one that came down, the first one. Four locos on that one. I've not seen that. It's got to be a cold one. Come on, keep going, keep going. No one told you to stop. Um, World at War. It's a Treyarch one. That was brilliant. That was possibly their best one was World at War tray up. Modern Warfare 1 and 2 were good. Didn't like Modern Warfare 3, that was just rubbish. That's when it all started to go downhill. I think Modern Warfare 2 was the best one by far. I, I can definitely say that. Yeah, you see, this is why I'm not overly keen on... Just the other reason why I'm not overly keen on doing OTR in a live stream. So it means I've got... If it crashes, then it just means I've just got to restart it. I lose the stream. Well, I've got to... I've got to do a COVID test in a couple of weeks. And um, I've got to have four days... Um, self-isolation so I might try and do those four days obviously there may be a stream within the four days but I'm gonna sort of see if I can get my Elgato stuff up to things so I can stream from via the PC
yeah, it's like I said yesterday, it was, but I suppose I've been streaming it yesterday. Um, but after Thursday night stream, when I finished, I had a little bit of a go on all the road and I somehow managed to go outside the cab view and sit on top of the lorry or something like that. And the, I got motion sickness because of the, the, move, the, the feeling of moving around and everything. Um, so yeah, I'm just like hoping if, if I'm actually sitting inside the cab, then I don't get motion sickness. So I'm, so I'm gonna try that tomorrow. I don't know, Darko, I'm too slow. Captain Slow here. It might be that I'll use it for um, uh, for uh, reversing. Jack, check my message in um, the back cave. I think it's it's not down to them. It's it's Microsoft, isn't it? There was a post on on the uh, on the road trucks in Facebook page. Okay, no worries. Like I said, I'm captain slow. Just let me know what you think. to Ben as well. Oh, what have we got coming in? Any headless rail gear? No. You CSX rubbish. This is a tank one. Oh wow. Well, there you go, block train of tanks with um, a lot of my wagons on it. Carry the seeds. <laughs> you lost the game by three kills. Yeah, I mean, sometimes you can, uh, you can unfortunately uh, do most of the most of the play gameplay and be even one of the ones with the top kills and you know the, the overall score but it just depends how good you, the rest of the players are really to be honest on your team okay that's cool it's actually what it's actually one that um, I've already done but AJ suggested it and I thought it was really really good so AJ probably not AJ sorry Arsenal Evan Evan will know what it is I don't want to hit it too hard. 
That's what she said. Yeah, the uh, you suggested um, Tony. What are you doing, donut? Oh. You suggested I do a service on Southeast High Speed, and I did it. And we're going to do it tonight. I don't know if you can remember what one it was, but don't say anything to anyone. Before we do that, I want to do eight. That's my train there. What's on these locos? Apparently, Matt said if you go high, you go faster. But you can't go that high. You can do it on train ship. Ooh. So, what we got down here then? Yay! 84-400 and all the rest of those okay right so we'll just do three Okay, so we're following this one in. It would be nice to do this without the rain. It's a bit of a pain in the rain. Yeah, yeah I know that then. I oh, know, he's just a young whippersnapper. I mean, I'm only a few years younger than you. Well, probably about 15 years younger. Class 52, Jack. Yeah, I usually like, if I'm pushing, which I will be, I like, in the rear lo rear end loco, I, I like to see where I'm going sort of thing, so I just, whoops, I just go out there. Plus you do realise I have to do the usual check. Next jack.
Seeing as I can't do my thing on SE uh, South Eastern High Speed, what I wanted to do, I'm going to go back to the um, Great Western Express and do one. I have an idea. Hold on, let's. I've got an idea. So he's. Where's he going now? Oh, there he is. Just a tad busy now, isn't it? One F O seven. I do know if you um if you start at Chatham there's about four or five I think it's five or six paths that you can choose to do which is good Well, I'll make sure I'm going back to the right place. Ah, no worries, no worries. I thought it was going to come off then. Southeast high speed with the HST this afternoon. I was running at 50 frames a second. How's that? I love the little tick over. Only 50. Yeah, but you know, PS4 Pro. Ah, oh, you probably got me on this one, Darko.
yeah, tops out at about 135 miles an hour. I tried it. In four car and eight car variants. Didn't beat it. Oh, 7305. Yes. Gold, Bradley. Oh, look at that. <sighs> to get the 500 points at the end, if you're not the leading loco like you see there, if you're in the rear loco, make sure you stop the rear loco that you're in on the on the stop area that way you'll get the 500 points right i just need to have a pnb been doing it all day lads don't worry about it be back in a second in the meantime is the child right on cue Oh, Jack. Ow. <laughs> he's copying it from his Word doc. I think he's still copying it. He's a, he, either that or he's typing it. Oh, right, okay. So just a funny thing to say. that I took the child, the Mandalorian thing, the child green Yoda baby thingy Rugal down. Just for my mum, because my sister hadn't seen it. And I put it on my mum's trolley. I just stroked its head as you do, like that. And he kicks off. And she, my mum was sat there for ten, ten minutes talking to it. She's crazy. She's absolutely... I wish I videoed it now and put it on YouTube. Because she's just crazy. Thank you, Bradley. <laughs> yeah, it happens. It started early with you. Um, right. Uh, just going to return to free roam. No, we're not. We're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. Right. I need to get my bearings. We need to go over here, don't we? See what else is about. This is a cold, dark night in the Allegheny, Allegheny Mountains. Right, what have we got over here? Oh! Another Hentisro AC4-400. There's a loco there, wasn't it? It's uh, CSX. Ah! So there is one there.
So I've not seen that running around yet, but it does apparently. Do you want one? Yeah, he's not for sale. Right, what's on the turntable? More CSX stuff. Yeah, right, okay. Well, that's it for the stamp patch. So, go back to the main menu. Southeast High Speed is next. So, that was a goal. I got a silver with the Southeast High Speed one. So, um, yeah, I want to try and improve that to a gold. Always believe in your soul. You know, you've got the power to know you're indestructible. Always believe in because you are gold. That one. All right, so how are we quickly doing on the journeys? This is a journey into sound. I've got 13 out of 75 done. Well, that's not too bad. Oh, I'm not going to bother going through all that lot. Right, okay, Southeast High Speed is next. Um, what was that? I've only seen the train bow once as well. Um, 1F07, it's about 6.30 I think it is. Um, do you know what? Because it's been cold. Oh. Oh, bless. He's got a little milk tash. wonder if you open his cup hatch. Nom, nom, nom. I'll stop that. Um, I'll have a little bit of... Oh, no snow. No. Just a little bit of snow falling down. There you go. I've not run the 37 on here yet. I don't think the 31's either. So 1F03, 1F07, sorry, is going to be 530. So it's going to be a bit darkish. That's going to be interesting. Um, the JNAs, they don't usually come up. Um, Why is that then, Flipper? JNA wagons that you did are not keen on coming up when you've been doing the freight run. Um, they tend not to. You can choose them. If it's a block train, they won't. You're in. Oh, we're going to go for this again all night, are we? I'm in. That's what she said. I'm in. <laughs> I even beat Jack. Right. Um, where are we? Unlock the doors. So you're already doing this already, aren't you? I think that's everything, isn't it? Yeah. Plenty of time will be spent in the driver's seat. I'll put a key in first. Um, I'm, what am I on? I'm on DC, aren't I? So slap that on. I just opened the doors on the right, haven't I? Duh. You see, this is going to go well, can't you? It's something on more than that cardi, love. It's a bit cold. Um, are the shoes down already? Yeah, they are, so I don't need to do power. That's already done then. Right, okay. Uh, to set the um, set me up here. What are we on? O oh, ten. Uh, 
Under 18. People are moaning that you can't, you can't do the, um, can't change the destinations. Yeah, I don't think you can use it with the Game Pass. Yeah, I had a feeling that I did. Being neutral, didn't it? Oh well. Oh, headlights. It was still dark, so. Um You can only hear the rail joins with the front two set of bogies. For the rest of the train, until you get to the rear power car, you can't hear anything over the rail joins. That's a bug. I can't hear the motors. All right. I don't know. I, I don't know about the Xbox Flipper, so I wouldn't know. I couldn't help you, unfortunately. Best thing to do is ask on the DTG. Um, why is everyone getting the bloody train bow? I'm not. Best thing to do, Flipper, just ask on the Dovetail forums. They'll be able to help you. They'll know straight away. So I don't have Xbox, so I can't really tell you, to be honest. Sorry. Sitting ball is next at five forty five. It's bloody nine o'clock already. Flipping heck. Well, I'm gonna be on till late anyway. Be on till about midnight or just after even. Don't make no difference to me, don't have work tomorrow.
Uh, where are we? Sitting Bourne, uh, four miles away. Motors are a bit quiet, aren't they? The bells, the bells, Esmeralda, the bells. Ah, yes. Yes, all the way through to Rochester, you are behind the service. I didn't tell you that on purpose. Evan didn't tell me that either. Is that guy from Cornwall up here then? Double yellows. And I'm doing this in the snow. So, um... I'm trying to see where it says this house is Bradley's. Give Bradley a suit. Good, hope he is. On yellow, that's good. He's just left sitting ball. I have I have on the road but there's a problem I have to sort out first I want to stream new model bus Oh, Bradley, you didn't. Right, what train's next through on the down? What the hell's that? Don't need to be on, really. Uh, what have we got? Raynham next. And that's 6.30, so... Really? Blimey. 
trains around here a bit sparse in the morning, aren't they? I thought it was supposed to be some commute about. You've got a new mic coming. Oh, cool. I can't believe Bradley spatted. Oh, loading and locked. What's that? Sorry, blue screen. Complete 150 passenger boarding tasks on the southeastern high speed route. Oh, cool. Deserves a celebratory horn, that. Notch four for Raynam. Notch four for Raynam. Oh, that's not good. So if you're enjoying the stream tonight, chuck us a like, chuck us a sub, say hello, join the Discord server. Off the sheer nest that way. Five miles to Raynham. Um, no, it's a celebratory horn because I got a trophy. Welcome there, Worthing fan. Oh, how you doing? Just wonder what all the mess, the, the notices that was coming through was. Um, no, the following Friday, the, every Friday, I take it it turns Darko. Um, so basically, this Friday, in theory, it should be on the road, but depending how my tests run with it tomorrow. If it's stable enough, and if it doesn't cause me motion sickness, then I will be streaming it on um, Friday. Then after that, it will be L.A. Noir. Near enough, Jack. Near enough. Not the same. Near enough, if you look closely. I did notice that. Oh... Get rid of that yellow. So basically, what I'll be doing is one Friday it's farm sim. Next Friday will be, or the following Friday, it will then go on the Fridays farm sim Grand Theft Auto. That light just went yellow. Um, Red Dead Redemption Two on the road. And then it will go to L.A. Noir, And then when we're done that, we go back to Grand Theft Auto. So I stream one game every five weeks. Or a different game every five weeks. Or one game every five weeks. Something like that. Oh, 
Okay. I think we can look at that later though, Bradley, can't we? Yeah, 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 this, it, it is, but um, literally I'm going to be running separate series, so they're all going to be on their own sort of um, uh, on the playlists on, on the YouTube channel. I think I've got to sit outside raining on this one. Well, I'm under yellow. I don't really want to go more than half the speed, that half the line speed. Because that way, for my sense, that if you go half the line speed, you you can probably make the still make the red signal if it doesn't change but sometimes if you're lucky enough you can um, you can also clear the red or get close to it just as it changes to a yellow Contact the signal, it doesn't work. Oh, okay, well, these, these usually work. Obviously, the signal is not there. What's the door? What's there? There we go, got a yellow. be in the station so we're going to be running late anyway unfortunately Just arrived at Rainham. Rainham.
a spotting spot. <laughs> I can't believe I've done 150 passenger loadings already from this route. It's crazy. Gillingham. Gillingham, sorry. Gillingham's in Dorset. Gillingham, 2.8 miles. That reminds me. Oh, my printer is on. Strange. problems with the uh, last night's stream either, which is pretty cool. Oh, better slow down to 60, haven't I? That's my printer going. That's some order, uh, eBay orders coming, so um, yeah. There's a unit in there. You don't get to use the washing plant thing on here either, it's a bit of a pain. for the boy in a box. Do you? Oh, cool. Scores on the doors at Gillingham. Gillingham, please. Gillingham's Dorset. Gillingham's Kent. Cool. 
There's no train in here. One dread. Next train in here. Mind your head. London Victoria 616. Well, that's not arrived yet. Have you done, obviously, when you do the, the tour, if you have a look at the platform where your tour comes in, instead of it being southeastern, on the tour it comes up as Dovetail. Oh, that reminds me, I've got some videos to sort out as well. Oh, look. Please stand behind the yellow line. Chatham at 6 p.m. a.m. Oh, blimey, Bradley. Yeah, I'm going to do the tunnel torn. Yeah, it is. Very nice little touch, that. Slam the brakes on now. I saw Dovetail put out a video for um, the Lunar new Chinese New Year sale for Steam. And then you had like disgruntled comments saying, nothing, um, this isn't for PS4 or Xbox then. I was just like, I, it was just begging to be answered. And I Ross gunned it. I said, that's why it's got Steam on it. Sorry guys, it just ha it just had to be done. If you enjoy the stream, chuck us a like, chuck us a sub. If you sub, don't forget to hit the bell icon because you'll be notified of every time when I upload content. Uh, go live like I am now. And... Um, make any community post this is the southeastern high speed route which has only just been released for about over a week it's a very good route very good route i do it's on my recommendation list this i would definitely recommend this if you had a spare 24.99 get it Exactly. It's down to Microsoft and Sony when they can. You know, you, you can talk about that until you're blue in the face. People will still go on about it. And this is. I kind of feel when I watched the, the roadmap on last Tuesday that um, Sam preempted everyone by saying, look, listen up. This is how it is. This is what's happening. Oh. Do you know what? I've forgotten something. I wouldn't want to 
want to do that, would I? Forgot that. Chester Rock. What the hell is Chester Rock? Bradley spat it again. This is not proving too good to your commuters when you first take the train out of <laughs> on Monday morning there, Jeff Bradley. I'd love to have a bit of snow. The last lot of snow we had that really caused any disruption was back in 2018. anyone's seen Colonel Failure's latest video with the 101 on the CGV line hilarious absolutely hilarious that's the Rainham service hi train spotting VGN yes you came in on Thursday wasn't it I believe Oh, it's a bit speeding. <laughs> Bradley's giving up. What route is next? Hapstracker Munchen Augsburg. It's a varied collection of routes. And I think you'll be surprised at possibly one or two of the routes that's coming up next. I've got five routes planned, but whether we do the full five routes or not, I don't know. Kind of hoping we do. We did. We do. Even. Rochester. Hi, right, Liam. You had thunder snow. Wow. I know it's been a bit more of a phenomenon, a ph phenomenon. Oh my god, I can't say it. Lately, you hear more and more news about it, but it's just like torrential rain, really. But it's just like torrential snow with a bit of thunder. Stop. Oh, get those five hundreds in. Where did you where did you spar, Brad? It wasn't in Jessica Ennis, was it? Was it? That's what she said, Len. Um, does the does the mic sound better with the old pop pop thingy on? If any of you noticed. for 607. two southern comforts before I came on so I'm really technically over the limit
this is great when you come round the corner and you see it, and you see a unit waiting on the line at the at the at the light there for you to clear it. Ah, yeah, because it's. Not, I, I don't think it's a bi-directional mic. That's a bit of a shame, really. <laughs> I just wonder. I just wonder what that said then, Evan. What's he doing with cat toys on trains him? I must be on the wrong route or something. Strood! We're at Strood! Oh, we're a little bit late. Um, I haven't actually had it. I've had it spawn next to me when I was at the station. It was on a 12 car service to Margate, I believe. You're now off to drop headlights off in Dortmund. So on on the road, when 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 you um, choose to do the route, you start. You're going to go to this place, and you're just going to go and pick up. You just go into the loading bay and then you just pick up. Do you not like designate it to, onto the lorry first before you drive there, or do you just like drive there, turn up, load there, and say I'll have that, so to speak? You have the train bar on the rear. <laughs> Two point four percent chance, yes. Let's go. This, I mean, even on the PlayStation, this console, cab console, looks so good. Oops. Well, I've blown that, haven't I? Designate it in the menu before you drive there. Oh, so you like you can click on the little area. Whoa! What's going on? So you can actually click on the, like the place where you want to go, and it will bring up a menu of what they need, sort of thing. Hello, Sam. Sorry, I forgot you. I didn't see you come in. I hope you're okay there. Oh man, come on, we're falling apart now. Jack's gonna take this. Oh no, we're okay. Come on, get up to 70. Five, even. I do apologise for not seeing you come in. Chuck us some likes, peeps. Chuck us some likes. Oh, I see. Okay. I'll have a little experiment tomorrow afternoon anyway. Passing higher. I have no idea where I am at the moment. 
still in the tunnel. Bradley, where are you? Oh, oh wait. Ooh. Um, I went for Scania. My brother drives a Scania lorry. have to wait till next Friday hopefully to find out what my company name is oh Jack that's below the belt bloody hell shots fired whoa blimey passing who passing when passing win <laughs> Graves ending 4.6 miles So I'm feeling more comfortable on the route now because um, I've played it, you know, you, you get used to playing it and everything. So, yeah. I'm loving it. I know you were, Jack. Um, I do have a steering wheel. I have a... Um, um, Logitech G29 steering wheel with shifter and paddles. Um, I also have a uh, racing games race seat. Can't remember what it's called now. Driven 395 miles. Going past who? 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 Where? Oh, who? Right, what have we got in? Oh. Another trophy, class 395, mastered the fast line. Right, what have we got? So we have 66, 718, 710, and it won't be a red one, it'll be 66, 718, oh, oh 817, sorry. Racing seat, that's what they're called. But um, it's not set up. The seats in the in the bedroom and the steering wheel and pedals is in the um, in the spare room at the moment where we shove all the all the stuff. Well, exactly. Whose junction is it? That's got to be the level crossing. There isn't a level crossing there. There's nothing in front of us. Or have we got something coming in? There's nothing there. Okay. I did blow the horn on the crossing. Right, a couple of minutes she'll be dinging me and she'll be wanting to go to bed. She's happy now that she's had her first dose of the vaccine. So, um, yeah, that's cool. My mate had his today. He's the same age as me. But he's extremely vulnerable. Extremely clinically vulnerable. I'm just clinically vulnerable. So I should get mine between February and April, I think. Apparently. Am I actually going to start breaking today or what?
Don't you get fined if you don't? No, I haven't. I was looking at the clock then, I thought, oh, I'm going to be on time. I thought, oh, no, I'm not. It's just at 6.18 now. You made it to Gravesend. I think the animation for the steering wheel on the... Um, in the game is going to be a little bit different it's going to be like sk very skittish if you're on controller if you're on a steering wheel it's almost authentic i think the only one that's managed to get that sorted right is grand grand turismo polyphony so PS5 front news, there isn't any. I don't do bus sims. Buses don't do anything for me apart from they get me from work and home again. Although if there is like a, a bus that we don't usually have down here, then I'll usually take a photo of it and stick it on Facebook saying, oh, look, we've got this here. And then there'll be loads and loads of my friends saying, oh, that's one of them. And I'm like, oh, okay. Oh, I need to see that because it's not been down here sort of things like yeah there are pictures a few years ago um go around facebook and then they're in the national press and strangely enough they got onto the tv of uh, some wilson dorset buses in california they were they were sold they were sold privately oh no and then they were moved to ship to um southern california and um yeah Uh, we're now more part of the Go South East Coast, Go South Coast branding. We used to be on, they used to be our own sort of Wilson Dorset buses, um, which was their own company founded ages ago, years ago. But then they got bought out by um, Go South Coast, I think it's called, because they do Solent Blue Line now. And I think, I think it's going to be Southern Vectors because we've got a couple of little small Southern Vectors buses that run around as well. But the company is known as Moore, M-O-R-E, which I think is a shit name, but there you go. That's just my decision. I prefer Wilson Dorset, to be honest, but hey-ho. It's Pacer. <laughs> nice one. The old Leyland bus. Dancing around the rail joints. That's it, Arsenal fan. Evan. <laughs> Let's whack a mole up to 65 then. Or 75. Well, I've only been on one and that was from Doncaster to Leeds. That was funny. And then we went, um, what were we behind? I think we were behind a 47 from Leeds to Settle. And then from Leeds, we went from Settle all the way up to Carlisle on one, on a 47. Oh, it's great. Then we caught uh, 
an overhead electric service back to London, Euston. Walked uh, down to um, Waterloo and caught a four rep and eight car TC service back to Pool. Fun days. And we actually saw 86401 Network South East Live Read 86 up at Carlisle, which was awesome. But I've got to make sure I follow this procedure correctly. So straight in front of us, that goes over to the North Kent lines. And we diverge onto the channel high speed thingy. I will catch up with the chat in a minute. Oh, I'm going so fast. So it just, as we pull into the station, she's just put the light on to tell me that she, she was off to bed. So um, I shall pull in here. I shall open the doors. I shall get as close to the stop board as I can. Southwest Main Line. It would be great to do that, but I don't hold your breath. Right, I'm just going to pause it there, get her, get her to bed, put her oxygen machine right, and I will be back in a, cup, in a couple of minutes. Take it easy, guys. I'll see you in a second. And I need to get another drink as well. Oh, I'm getting too old for this.
Yo. Oh, let's catch up on the check. Chat. What have we got? Um, you're back. Hi, Joe. You prefer Scania than man? Okay. Not to be focused when you know it's live. It's not easy, to be honest. Um, because obviously you're you're concentrating on driving and at certain speeds and everything. And then you also look at the chat. This is why I have Jack and Bradley as moderators. So if anyone kicks off in there, they can deal with it. If needs be, then I can just pause the game like now and then help them as well. So, but they're there usually that I don't. Um, you only went man, so the game don't break. <laughs> Um, you start again and get scan, yeah. They should hopefully sort it out, hopefully for you guys. Um, on the road's great. So did you, any of you guys, did you ever bother getting truck driver at all? Did you stream it will be on Twitch? Okay. Um... That's cool. I won't worry about your birthdays. Let them all spoil your rotten then. Yeah, I, th I think Twitch is, but there again, I get I all my train stuff is on YouTube, and I get paid on YouTube. And I don't want to have to start all that over again just to start streaming on Twitch. <laughs> you have played truck driver once on the disc but took it to CEX yeah it's not the best is it right okay so let's get going I need to right let's do this right um, control uh, CTRL sorry um, I've got to hold it for two seconds haven't I There we go. That's what I was doing wrong. And then pan up, shoes down. And then pan up, shoes down again. And in theory, pans up, shoes are down. Even. Well, my shoes are up, down. What have I done wrong there, Bradley? That's what she said, Darko. Oh, okay. Well, why are my shoes that? Why are my shoes still down? Well, that one. That one's up. So that's bugged then, isn't it? Isn't it? So we're now over on kilometres an hour as well. Next stop is Stratford at 6.33. I think, I just, I have a funny feeling there's a there's a bug with the front shoes. Hashtag dead build.
walk factor five. I'm just going going into the tunnels. Right, well I don't need the wipers on. I think we're also getting the patch for this this weekend as well. This week, but it won't be everything that they listed on the um He's happy on the um on the roadmap stream. There'll be certain bits of it. I love the cab, it's really cool. And the fact you just walk out the cab into the passenger compartment is really good as well. tired he's fallen asleep I don't think that was Trainbow actually that's the first one I've actually seen that's the first one we've seen today in this pancakes <laughs> love it so 12 miles to go to Stratford at 6.33 5 minutes roughly so in real life if I was to press this this button here it puts I think it's that no is it that one I think it's that one it puts every signal in the five mile radius to red I think it is or something like that Bradley correct me if I'm wrong Approaching 225. Starry, starry night. Oh crap, I'm going to get copyright struck now. <whistles> Maximum warp. Top red does that. Ah, right, okay, it's that one. great because the 37 or well, the advanced 37 pack uses all this this slot here I think a couple of other ones the is it the the, the set pack does it the 412 and 411 pack now does it as well I mean this is the other thing as well which I like about the route for about the first 20, well, about the first 40, 50 minutes, you're doing top speed 80 to 90 miles an hour and stopping at loads of stations sort of thing. Ooh, best slow it down a bit, it's getting a bit punchy. And then all of a sudden, as soon as you leave Ebbsfleet, you're doing... Two ton and 25 kilometers an hour and you're only stopping at one station and it's that sort of interactivity obviously where you have to change like the power over you know the power mode down from from uh, third rail DC to overhead AC Yes, well, yeah, I'm sure they do, yeah.
Oh, Joe, what are you blowing fuses for? It's not very good. Is there anyone that's not liked the stream yet? If you're watching, you've not liked, please give me a like. Helps me out a lot. An awful lot. Four and a half miles from Stratford International. Oh, Stratford International. We're not going to get there at 6.33, I can assure you of that. We'll get the diggy in a minute to slow down. The, what was it I was read as well? This in this thing about someone was saying about all the. There we go. Let's slow down. The uh, how the route is rubbish because it's got holes in it. The buildings are floating in certain areas of the map, sort of thing. And um. It's just like there's one bit I noticed where they're going on and on about the tunnel. I think it's the tunnel from between, is it St Pancras to Stratford? There's something wrong with it. And they turned around and, and this is the thing what they were saying about that the, the, they had the problem with the lighting in the tunnel. And um, I swear people do not watch the live streams certain people they just do not watch the live streams they 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 don't and they're the first ones to moan when something doesn't look right and when you say to him it's like oh i don't have time to it oh okay fine i had that i think we had that with someone tonight they were asked if they're going to watch the live stream he goes oh i don't have time blah 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 and all that sort of stuff but you got time to talk to someone else fine what are you doing on the server then sorry but I think you're going to get a little bit more than me, Jack. We're below 100. Come on, let's go. Yeah, that's what I think, you know. Just out of curiosity, Bradley, you don't blow the horn when you go in and out of the tunnels on here, do you? Yeah, exactly. I know, Bradley. I know. Um, how did you know Arla White was on the agenda tonight? is on the agenda after we do Hapstrecker Ryan Hap, Hapstrecker Munchen Augsburg we're going to be doing the Isle of Wight and the last route is going to be an English route as well can you work out what that route is Four nine nine. No, Jack. No, Bradley. I don't know how to take that, Barry. I really don't. No, Jack.
no Bradley. It depends if we got time, actually. I think we have. No, it, no, Jack. It's not East Coast away either. No, Bradley. No parrot in here. Tin pancakes. It is the West Somerset Railway. It's going to be the last route. <laughs> I'm actually going to do something on the West Somerset Railway. Yes, Bradley, West Somerset Railway. Thank you, Barry, for the follow. Appreciate it. Oh, Lord, yeah. And I've had some sudden comfort tonight as well, so yeah, got to be very careful. I've done well so far. Touch wood. I mean, if we don't, if we don't do it today, tonight, we will do it Thursday. But I'm gonna be. I'm gonna. I don't think I'm gonna. I'm not gonna finish at midnight. I don't think, unless I'm really tired. Oh, that reminds me. Hold on a minute. I just got um, 3.7 miles. I've just got to go next door and get something. Hold on. It's really weird walking in the next room. You're still in the cab and you hear the um, thingy go off. Do we have to go 25? What do you mean 25? Um, I just passed one of it. I wouldn't say it's a scenario. I had to I had the controller with me I just walked just left the mic here because obviously it's on the boom here it's on the boom and um, I just took the controller with the headphones with me and walked in the other room but it's just kind of weird like you hear the DSD go off it's like oh hello so I was there carrying something else what I needed and um, yeah, it's like push the button, Tony, push the button. 25 mile an hour fun, oh yeah. Why am I breaking? After I get to St Pancras and before I do the Hapstracker lunch in Augsburg, I've got to pop downstairs quickly. We just hit the AWS. Yes, we have. I 
Thank you, Video Studio Ultimate 21, for popping up right in front of my face. Go away. Or do you not get the end of the prize? Oh! Going too fast. trick that I learnt. Just a couple of minutes late. Jack's going to beat me, unfortunately. How do you not manage to speed down here, Bradley? A train bow in there. train bow that's true really doesn't distract me one bit Fifteen thousand and seventy nine. That's a nice shot. It's always someone that gets in the way, isn't there? See, the other thing as well, if you're doing, um, doing a scenario, you can only go off from platform 11 or 12. You can't do platform 13 for some strange reason. Um, I haven't found the donkey. I've no idea where it is. I think it's at Chatham somewhere. But I've not looked, really. how the soundproofing is in here as well.
Come on then, what do we do? 15-3-29. Oh, that's okay. I've already got a... Ah, oh, now it should, would it give me the gold? I only got a silver on this, so it should have given me a gold. That's a bit dodgy. Oh, we're not at the end of the stream. Don't worry about that. Oh, that's good, Jack. I don't want to see that. Yeah, not the end of the stream yet. Don't worry about that. Whoa, no. No, 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 no. Oh, excuse me. Um, 7.22. I ain't waiting around. Get off. I ain't waiting around that long. Let's see what else we've got around here. Bradley, what's this here then? You're not sorted. <laughs> it's time for the ham and cheese. Yes, ham and cheese is next. It's a soldier animal trailer on OTR, so you can buy a box one. Oh, cool. Um, yeah, surely you make enough money on it. Though. I bet there's people already going, oh, I want to cheat. And there we go. That's, uh, that's us done on that route. That sounds like my my thingy alarm. Turn flashlight on car. Oh, okay, sorry. That thing there. Some sort of box. <laughs> no, you get to you get you get the privilege to go at um 200 and something kilometers an hour. It's a nice little cup, cup holder there as well. Ooh, with a bit of tea stainage in there, look. Is that another cup holder? Oh, hey, spot me there. Oh, it's a. Is that right? That's supposed to be upside down then, Bradley. Oh, it's a save. No, I don't think it's a save. Well, it could be a personal effect save. It just looks a bit weird having that there. I think it's obviously so the cable isn't dragged on, so the cable goes upwards instead of downwards. Right, anyway, must carry on. Never used it. Oh, okay. Can you also double check them when you go in there next to see, like, should that be like that? Or is that DTG just, like, doing something they shouldn't be doing? I've not really looked at the cab, actually. It's not something there. Is that... Is... I'm going to try and break it. Hey, can I do the horn? Hey! Yeah, he's got a really good view, the old second man, hasn't he? Uh, I think I'd rather be driving it, to be honest. Must not use use track circuit operating clips first to protect the line. Must not use on the CTRL. Keep this doorway free of obstructions. Oh, what have we got here? Isolate power supplies. This is the old wooden stick, isn't it? In the red flag, you go running around, go, stop! Anyway, right, okay. On with the... Um, ham cheese pizza right right while this is loading in do you drive on your own brad or do you still with the instructor person one way up it's not meant to be like that oh okay oh, that's interesting what are you gonna uh, ah we had some bloke telling me that i had to blow the horn Last was it last Saturday? Go oh, there, he would, he because I was I was using I was shunting around. Sorry, I was switching around in the yard. I had to use the horn. Yeah, like that was not going to work. Telling me I had to use the horn. Mhm. Mm like that's not going to go down too well. 
Hapsdracker Munchen Ausberg. Right, I'm just going to click on that. I've just got to pop downstairs and have a quick look at something. I'll be now I'll be back. And get myself another drink. Non alcoholic, of course. Okie dokie. Right, let's get a bit warm it. Right, where are we? I've actually sat in the, uh, they've got photos, which I will try and find out and stick on the Discord server. Uh, for about 2016, I think it was. I've actually sat in a Desario, Desario, Desire, Desiro driver's seat um, in pool sidings. Um, I can't remember if it was a 444 or 450. I think it was a 444. Actually, it's, it's crazy because how I think about it now is that it was oh, it's just crazy it really was absolutely crazy because I went down there to see what was it it was Britannia might have been Britannia I don't know I can't remember I got some nice shots of it um, no it wasn't it was uh, Tangmere in the yard at Poole and um, I actually went down on a 444. It was a 444. Yeah, we walked down there in the 444. The driver went to get some photos. And then basically we came back in a 444 as well. And that's where I managed to actually get some shots of the uh, of the driver's cab. And those those steps, you know, you like in, in between certain sidings, you have like a little concrete walkway sort of thing, which is not very, not very wide. And walking up those steps, when you've got the lines either side of you, it's, it kind of unnerved me a bit. Because there's no handrails, there's no grab rails. So if you fall, if you slip, you know what I mean? It's just like you can go over and hit on, onto the line and that. And it's just like, you know, the third rail's either side on the outside of both lines and that. But yeah, it's, um, it's a little bit of a hefty fall. Tangier the Terrible, yeah. Uh, no more South Eastern. No, we've done that run, which was it was quite good, quite a nice little run actually. I didn't realise how um, realise how long it took me. But now we're actually doing the Hapstracker Munchen Augsburg, which is um, I can't remember which one it is. Are we we going to into Munchen? I think it is. Um, it's not that one. It's starting off strong. Um. Yeah, it's ice 593. Is it 593? Yeah. Some I went through and I thought I want to do a HMA one today, a German one. 
so yeah, I've, I've got the pictures, and I'll um, put the pictures up in the photo share. I think it is. Oh, I had. Um, was it a Siemens high vis, or was it my Hentis Rail high vis? I can't remember. Because I did, I, I had my EWS bag, driver's bag, with me, and. Um, Long story. I don't work. For, I don't drive for EWS, um, and I do carry my Hentis Rail high vis bat thing in there because I was going to be do all all this high vis stuff that I was buying with Hentis Rail logo on there. I was going to be doing stuff with someone down at Swanage Railway, so I had to get a load of high vis stuff. Um, it didn't happen. Um, so I'm probably glad about that to be honest. House on the hill, look. Um, West Somerset will be the last one. Yeah, it's it's Hapstrecker, um, Munchen, Augsburg next, and then we got Isle of Wight, and then we got West Somerset. Uh, drive the eastbound Ice Intercity Express service to Munchen non-stop. Oh, nice. That'd be fun. Unlock doors. It's been a while. I'm back, baby. It's been a while. Um. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh where are we going? We're going to where are we going? Munch uh Munich. Let's... Augsburg, yeah, we're going to Munich. Oh, Jesus. Oh, let's press down to your donut. There you go. Munchen, half ban off. Press enter. And then we do UD again. I'm not worried about unlocking doors. And I've done the wrong doors. Do five five twice. Come on. Lights are on, no one's home. Um Cifa. I'll tell you what, I'll put Cifa on. Uh where's Cifa? I'm not doing PZB. I'll have to do that on learning it at some point. Do I want people staring at me? Yeah, I'm not bothered. Um, unlock doors. I know I've done the wrong doors. <laughs> so I thought sort it. I think we've got everything sorted. At least it's not raining. I'll tell you what, this this little raised pathway that I was talking about between two the two trains on the sidings, it's probably I'd say it's about the size of this platform, if not a little bit thinner. Uh, 14.10. 14 14.10? 20 minutes. Yeah, we might get there. <laughs> Donut Snaffle Strucker Happy Snaffle, yeah, 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 the Snaggle Puss.
I think this would be the first time that I've been driving Southeastern High Speed and West Somerset in the same stream. All right, all right. Calm down, love, calm down. I'm going to teach the child to say Sifa. Hi, Ellen. Ah, but you didn't really complete SEHS, did you? <gasps> Ooh, shots fired. <laughs> even, even Graugu thinks it's funny. Yeah, it's strange, that, isn't it? That's okay, Darko. You can always watch and catch up as well. So have a lovely evening. And uh, what time is it there with you? It's got to be about, what, midnight? One o'clock, something like that? Twenty-three forty. Oh, see, so you're an hour ahead. Uh, Five hundred comments, people, as well. That's pretty impressive. Thank you all for that. Oh, I've forgotten. Now I'm doing automatic, so I've got kilometres on. That's going to be interesting. Night there, Darko. I do those videos. Hold on a minute. Oh, thanks, Brett, uh, Barry. Guys, what video did I release? This week, it was the last episode of Baker Lou, wasn't it? Walking the route, or last week. Oh, I'm gonna have to have a look at that. Yeah, that was the last episode, wasn't it? So in theory, I've got a train sim short being released this week. I don't think I think it's uploaded, but I've not sorted it. So I'm gonna have to do that tomorrow. And then next week it would be the first episode of Main Special Bar walking the route. That's ten episodes. That come on, Tony, put your foot all down. Warp speed. Oh, cool. I don't know what I do when I've run out of all world routes to walk on. 
thought there was a station there then. <laughs> nice one, Evan. <laughs> To be honest, that 205 kilometers an hour does not look as fast as the um, javelin. Jack, have you got the Xbox Series X, the big black fridge one, or the uh, the other one? Um, I've done a live walk in the route with um, with uh, Tees Valley. That's what, strangely enough, that's what took. Taught, um, gave me the idea of doing walking the route in episodes. You got the Series S. What ones? Is that that's the digital one, the little one, yeah. Okay, Bradley. Ah, oh, right, okay. My mate has the um, the big black one, and he said there's so much heat it creates, it's unbelievable. fiddling with buttons. Yeah, I noticed my PS4 gets a lot hot, even after I do the um, delivery designer. I mean, if you get out of the, out of the countryside, you get... Out of the built-up area on this route, you tend to get a more stable frame rate. There's the occasional drop. Series S is quite hot, said Jack. You might want to rephrase that, said Bradley. <laughs> Brilliant. Yeah, 
Is it? There was some guy who I can't. Remember, they, they were saying something about the Hapstrack and this this route, Hapstrack and Munchin Ausbag, Ausbag, Ausberg route on Facebook. This was the train trip well. And there's some little note always thinks you know. Oh, he was moaning about the lack of the layers on there, saying why is it the PC players have got it? You know the route is crap anyway. Blah 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 blah. And I mean I just replied with yeah. Well if you think the route is crap, why are you moaning about it? I said also the fact that in between around the, the Munich area there's over 5,000 signals that require pathing and coding. Why do you think they're not putting the layers down on the console? Well, they've taken the layers away for the time being because it needs optimi optimizing more. You know? Some people are just so. Then you've got the PC Master Race. Yeah, well, let's just forget about them. PC or nothing. Bye then. Hi, Worthy, fan. I thought she said knees up then. Knees up. Knees up. That was bang. <laughs> yeah, TEA wa uh, tankers. It's a nice route, this. Guys, when you get time, look at the um, look at the video release for the Dresden to Riser route for train sim. It's it's a really nice route. And I was thinking that that would be nice in train sim world. Have a look at it. I mean, it's, Matt does it. Matt drives it. He also Nebworths the station as well, which is pretty impressive. Um, and Natalie's there on there as well. And actually, it's just like, I've got to admit, she's growing on me a bit. I'm getting to like her. So, I find her, in some respects, she's a little bit funny. Not as cold as she used to be, sort of thing. Don't take it the wrong way. But, have a, have a look at the stream, because it is quite good. There's the BR1460 and the BR1462, which does the Dosto stuff. There's the BR Talent 442. And there's the BR101, which does the freight. You get loads of pink containers. The old one, Ocean Network Express containers, the pink ones. All the white containers with pink lettering or pink containers with white lettering. Apparently they got this huge big pink cargo ship as well. Container ship. Oh, I'm not gonna make that. Yeah, but I watched it last night and the rest of it this morning and yeah, it was it's a, I was so tempted to get it. So tempted to buy it. I never I don't know, I, I might do. Might do. See. <laughs> Squeeze up. Yeah, Barry, that's true. The, the layers would make it better. And I've, 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 I've had a run with, um, with the ice train from Munchen to Augsburg, or the other way round. I can't remember. Um, with freight trains running. As you approach um well with all the other free layers running the whole the whole free other free layers so you got the dosto the regional the 442 was it i think it was and the freight and um yeah it was um you get closer to 
Munich, it, it does slow down a lot. But to me, I was expecting it. My PlayStation didn't crash, which is pretty good news. It's into a different loading bay, oh dear. It's just like GTA. will be doing a livery tutorial on Mondays so it's alternate Mondays one Monday it will be Natalie doing the livery tutorial the other Monday it or the following Monday it will be uh, Sam doing the um, scenario creator Mine didn't, Jack. My my console was fine, honestly. I made it from Augsburg to uh, Munchen. Had no problem. It was a bit slow in places, but yeah, it didn't crash. Around um, Munich, it was it was a bit slow, but um, yeah. So doing a non-stop run from Augsburg and not stopping at that Munchen Pausing or Passing or whatever it is. But this is the same thing how it worked with the um, with the Great Western Express, and they've not even stopped that. They must know about that little workaround to get all the services for a Great Western Express. They must know about it. Get the AI services. <laughs> parked in an accept oh, acceptable position. I was thinking, what station is he parked at then? Zipa. Zipa. Uh, I'm 9.8 kilometres. See now it's starting to slow down a bit. We're hitting. We're going from 40 to sort of 35 down to about 20. So yeah. So obviously hitting built up area with the depot. So we're nine kilometres. Wow. So we're all in this area from here, in this nine kilometre area. There's over 5,000 signals. I mean, you can see how many signals are here, look. So you can understand why there's that many signals. If it doesn't, yeah, as I said, if it doesn't affect gameplay, we won't look into it. But it does affect gameplay, that's the thing. So this is what all the, they're trying to opt, do all the optimising. I mean, it's not been a bad run, to be honest. It's, it's starting to do a bit now. But the other thing is as well, you've got all these stations with the um, with the little the TV screens on them as well. And there's not one screen, it's loads of screens on each platform. I mean, it, it's annoying it stops, but it doesn't, to me, it doesn't just, you know, you, you, I won't say it stops, but it it lags there's no it's no loss in gameplay overall gameplay to me i i don't you know i paid 24.99 for it i know but uh, you know what i mean it's just like yeah it's still enjoyable otherwise i wouldn't be doing it
and this is one of those typical routes that I like because you're undulating everywhere. You're going all over lines, under lines, next to lines. And it's nice to see a train that's going up past you and as you go underneath it sort of thing. Again, you can see the ice train there, just over there, just spawning in a bit. That's just how it is, you know. Now we're starting to stay on a stable yellow frame rate. The odd dipping into the red. But obviously, towards the more we get to uh, Munich, it's going to dip into the red a bit. But it, you know, and there's going to be a lot more pop up. But it doesn't bother me one bit. Yeah, exactly. I agree. I agree there, Barry. It is, it is fantastic. But look at the video that they do for Train Sim, uh, the the release for the uh, Dresden to Riser route for Train Sim. It it's fantastic. I mean, it's an awful amount of uh, rolling stock that you get there as well, which is pretty cool. And obviously Zipa. later, Zipa. later on this year, we're also. Shush, I'm talking. We're also getting the BR 101 as well. But I don't think we're getting the, the coach, the, the white intercity coaches. So is that time of day where you got some units in, in the sidings? Bunch of hat van off, that's the old washing plant. Hi GT. Oh, what have you done, Jack? Oh, I think I better start slowing down a bit more, haven't I? So, I mean, we're still at, what, 25 frames a second? 6,045 on a gold. Ooh, so there's a little bit of a stop there, but I thought that was my phone starting then. You haven't just... Oh, you've MNSed it. You haven't just hit the buffers. You've... Hit the buffers. It's photo, it didn't happen. <laughs> I think Brad might just win this one. I bet Brad was sailing through it at 60 frames a second as well. Stayed on the rails. Well, that's pretty good. If that was me, my train would have been flying off out the station somewhere in all directions. I can officially say that Nifa woman is doing my head in. Well, you've seen the Marks and Spencer adverts. You know, this is just not blah 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 insert product here this is even our special brand product it's not a special one it's an extra special one so to speak am I going to um, jack it Nifa. Okay. Didn't get as close as Jack, though. Ooh, shots fired. Like 
How late was I? Do you not board? And the clock still don't do not work. I love it how they use the same signs of what we got on the um, on the uh, on the Great Western Express, and they just turn them into German. <laughs> Didn't, you didn't just get close, you hit it. Yeah, that's it, you MS, MS it. Lock the doors. Guten Tag. What's up next? Uh, what do I get? We got 5,730, I believe. Who won that one? Evan, you once tried reading those signs in German, you got four words in and gave up. <laughs> That's more farther than what I got. Or further, even. Right, so it's the Isle of Widget next. That's okay, no boys golden ticket. Brad's already gone, then. You're a bit slow on that one, mate. There's a house on the hill. Looking out for love. You got 6,900, 6,090, so you won. I don't know what Brad you got, sorry. Really? Oh, that's cool. Um, you won't need to speak German on the Yard of Widget. The Yard of Widget. So, it's going to be a scenario. So, this is going to be a bit long, apparently. It's a 50-minute scenario. So, this is the last scenario as well. So, I may get a trophy. That's if they've done that you get trophies for doing all the scenarios. So it's the morning startup. <laughs> Oops. Well, at least you never ploughed into the buffer stops at Essen. I did it, and I did it better than what MNS could do it. That guy that's had his head over the E, underneath the E in Munchen, it looks like he's having a look. Oh, there's a train now, I'm going to photograph it. Morning startup. Oh, it's raining. All the passenger area of the train. Do you know what? I swear I've done this. But hey ho. Nice that these don't work. Climb aboard. You know what? Oh, passenger lights on. Let's sit here, shall we? Okay, what have I done wrong? Well, this is broke already. Blah. sat in the front coach
I wonder if he's actually got any money for that. Just fundraising. Well, that's coming to us. So I've gone round opening all the doors. Sorry, I might as well do the windows as well. It's going to be a damp dog smelling day today. It's just about rising. Okay. Oh look, seagulls. I'll tell you what, they look more like bloody um, pterodactyls. Of an offensive behaviour or language directed at Island Nine staff will not be tolerated under any circumstances. <laughs> nope. Wouldn't it be funny if this thing actually spads? Turn around and say the AI ain't perfect after all. Either. You know, just for that, Evan. Just for that. Whoa, where'd you come from? Remind us. Remind us who spatted Bradley. Are you gonna put the windscreen wipers on, love? How can you set up front? There's nothing to sit on. Apparently the island line is going to be shut until May now. Multi-purpose fire extinguisher. Very multi-purpose because you can throw it at someone if they get really annoy you.
Um, can I just actually point out? Now she's sitting in the seat. <laughs> Can't find the video. What video? I can definitely tell you that this what this one this scenario will be shortened, like the um, GWE one. Okay, I'll do it that way then. I'll keep dry. Then I can go and turn the coaches on. Hold on. Dwarf mode off. There we go. Oh, I've not turned the power on, have I? Press the override reset button. Set the handbrake lever to zero. I've got a vice like this at home. When you go to Colne, does it have the um, cathedral with the uh, railway station there? All right, I'm now on the uh, the water. Foot across in there. Turbo mode activated.
No, I didn't mean to do that, you donut. Okay. Whoa. I'm on, where are you? Right, St. John's Road. Oh, we're going via, so we're going to Shanklin, then we're doing a full lot, aren't we? Oh, I've got, whoa, 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 whoa. I've got to look at this one. Now, what was this one, Bradley? Is that the one where I, um, did That's All She Wrote? Train Simulator. Um, but it depends what you want for it. That's All She Wrote. Oh, my God. I'm going to have to watch that one. Um, is Train Simulator worth buying? Um... If you've got a good high-end PC, you don't mind spending £25 on a route. But with the Steam sale, you can pick up routes and DLC for a lot less. So, yeah, it depends what you want to do with it. Wasn't that towards the end of the stream, though, Bradley? That's all she wrote. I seriously need to ed download that video and edit that out. Yeah, I don't think you'll do very well on that. My laptop plays Trains in World. But that's about a three, four year old laptop now. On my PC will play it, because that's like a year. It's about eight. I had it in July, I think it was last year. July, August, something like that. Super 47 at Rye Pierhead and just burst out laughing. Was that a bus or a 47 from Train Sim? Well, my laptop can no, my laptop can and can no, no, don't stop you, donut. My laptop can run Train Sim. Sorry, not Train Sim World. These are the sort we got two of those buses, these Southern Vectis things down there, just that sort, short things. Bloody horrible, to be honest little runabout town things so we're running from ride pierhead all the way down to um shankin I 
I've no idea to be honest. I read that as A O A O L in Byro. Alright. We had um for a while there's one from West Yorkshire. Bus down here. Was it Bradford? Bradford or West Yorkshire, I can't remember what. It's like a creamy pay creamy one. Ah right. Is it Reading? Is it Reading buses for Reading or something like that? Locked doors. Doors are locked. Oh, doors unlocked. Donuts done the other doors. So it doesn't tell me that I've got to change ends. Whoa. <laughs> Twins, they obviously don't like each other. Can I um, get through the door, please? Mind your knees, love. I'm going to whack them. Yeah, we're part of the go-ahead group, more buses. I use a phone app to pay for my buses. Stagecoach, oh dear.
Oh, these earphones hurt me ears after a while. We get yellow buses as well, they're part of Bournemouth. Oh. And what was the other one? The first group do run us down through the Jurassic Coast down to um, uh, Weymouth. Can we do Riper Intermittent? No. <laughs> That's going to be annoying. Ah, locks the doors. Put her in first. Take the brakes off. One of these things are breaking, I'm driving them too fast. First can't bloody run anything, they always give it up. What's, what's happening with the Southwestern franchise? There's more 444s being done in, um, what do you call it, delivery? I just leave this place. Island line service. We'll get you there eventually.
Excuse me, mate. You either want the train or you don't. It's too villagey for me, Lime Regis. Yeah, you, mate. You either want the train or you don't. There is a bus there. CCTV camera on the signal box roof. You know what? I swear I forgot to shut the doors. Oh no. Okay, chat. Speak to you later, mate. The hell? Well, that was a bit weird. Hey, you want to see my underground train? Oh, there it is. Well, at least the passengers can still get one. Mm, maybe not. Shut those doors. Right, guys, I'm just going to change my headphones over a second. These are starting to hurt my ears.
you hear me okay? Testing one, two, one, two. Can you hear me? Okay, okay, guys. Yeah, okay, cool. That's good. Yeah, they're just... The earphones... The only problem I find with the earphones is they hurt my ears after a while. And I've had them on for about three hours. Cool. So you might just hear me heavy breathing now. <laughs> well, you shouldn't do, but... Come on, let's get up the 40. Raiding platform one is the next stop. If you've done it once, you can do it again. Yeah. Seems like they got a LOD issue here. Ah, you'll be fine. I didn't check my emails today either. The benefit of having the um, just the mic on the headphones is that I can actually just sit back in the chair and relax. <laughs> the 
Yeah. I suppose I'll be doing the trucks next Friday and then you'll be all be playing trains. A second. Right. right, let's get the hammer down. Something to do with Eddie Stobart, I suppose. Just takes practice. So I've not done a walk in the route on the Isle of Wight. Next to Arm um, Sandown Platform 2.
probably it's eight miles, isn't it? So it won't be that long. It'll probably I'll, I'll tell you what, it could probably be done in a live stream. Where the hell have we got a 10 mile an hour limit? Do not know. That these trains cause so much turbulence be between them. Norton Lifelock, your subscription ended due to payment failure. Never even had Norton Lifelock. So, yeah, it didn't end due to payment failure. It ended because I never even had it in the first place. That's that's two so far um, spam emails that I'm, I'm just looking at. <laughs> nice one. Secure your PC with McAfee. That's another one. Renew now. Apparently, my McAfee uh, license ran out as well. Uh huh. Okay. Fine. That's junk, that one. And that's junk, that one. I wonder who's doing this. Oh, I don't think so. Okay, so you know when you got a spam email, basically when it comes up with RE important update for the 11th of February 2021, you look at the way they spent, spelt important, I-M-P-R-T-A-N-T, mm-hmm, spell checker works then, not... Might be a bit of a gaper this one.
Oh, PlayStation wants my opinion. They'll get that later. Off to Shanklin Platform 1. Apparently my Symantec Norton Secured account has expired today and is now limited on my computer. Okay, fine. So I get about three or four spam emails from the same email place a day over the last week. Just wonder who... Uh, Managed to sign my name up for that then. Actually, I'm going to leave some of these emails there. And I'm just going to basically uh, set these up to be moved straight into the delete pile. There we go on that one.
And there we go. Hey, another trophy. Oh, bit of a bronze though. High O bronze. Right, let's continue. Right, shall we leave? Hmm. Um. You're the boss man. Yes, I am the boss man. 6,540 in the silver. Oh, well done. 7,260. I don't know what mine was. Sorry, I didn't look. Yeah, it looks okay, actually, which is pretty cool. So I appreciate it for them. So that's really cool. Right, we're going to do... We are going to do... I did say we're going to do it. And we're going to do West Sunset. So stay with me to the early hours of the Sunday morning. I am the boss man. And the ones it's going to be, apparently. Happy Sunday all, by the way. Oh, too far. I think this was the first bit of DLC that was released for Train Sim World. Oh, thanks, Barry. Yeah, I wasn't concentrating a lot, but that's just down to me, really. <laughs> Right. Was it in the... I don't think it's in the training. Well, I've not done the 33 introduction or the 52 introduction, so they need to be done at some point. Not tonight, though. Um, the preparation work was one of them. Um, that's the 30 minute. I don't know. We're not going to do that one yet. No, come on. Where was it? it is, no, it wasn't exploring on foot. It was in journeys. Oh, I might do 26 and a half, Evan. Oh, okay. So, West Somerset doesn't want to load. There we go. So, 47 introduction. Preparation work. I think we'll just do the 47 introduction. The preparation work is half an hour. I'm not really going to... I don't really want to stay on that long. I can really do 26 miles in a bit. Yeah. Why not? Cool. Yeah, could do, do could do okay with this, uh, this, uh, this. Ow, with donations as well. But you know, you can't force money out of people. <laughs> and I've got to stop spadding as well. I'm sure I've done this. I like it how it's randomised every time you choose the loco. But it's never ever. This is a class 47 diesel electric locomotive in British Rail Green. You can't livery. choose it yourself. This tutorial will go through the start and stop procedure. Climb aboard to get going. Enter the cab through the door indicated. When you're ready, sit in the driver's seat. A lot of time will be spent in the driver's seat. To get the loco started, set the battery isolation switch to the closed position. Da -ding. To activate the control desk, set the master key into the on position. Set the reverser into the engine only position. The locomotive is now ready to be started. Push the engine start button on the control desk. 
To release the air pressure holding the wheels, set the driver's brake to the running position. With the locomotive running, to get going, set the reverser to the forward position. To make others aware that this loco is operational, switch the headlights on. Turn the parking brake handle to release it. Finally, to get going, set the throttle to at least 20%. <laughs> No hornage. I can't do anything else than that. I'm waiting now for it to get to 10 miles an hour. They won't do... I mean, a lot of people want announcements at stations, but I'm not being silly bit like level crossing gates really going up and down you're not gonna see him go up and down not unless you actually sit at the level crossing to see him up go up and down <laughs> can't use the horn I haven't hit 10 miles an hour yet. Good God. Well done. The loco is on the move. Yay. To maintain a specific speed, set the throttle back to the off position. Bring the locomotive to a gentle stop. Set the driver's brake to the initial application position. Like that. Take this basic training and apply it to further operations and you'll do great. And there we go. I do believe I've done that. And that, as they say, is that. Okay, it was a small bit for rest on a set railway. But I didn't realise it was going to be that late, to be honest. Um, did I, I tell you what, did I do the 09? I'll do the 09 as well. This is a class 09 diesel electric shunter used mainly for freight operations, but known to help with passenger procedures too. Let's take a look at the engine's starting and stopping procedures. Climb aboard to get started. Enter the cab through the door indicated. Now I'll go through the roof panel instead. Does she look pretty?
Before anything else, set up the marker lights. Turn the main switch on the panel up there to on. I don't think they do enough for shunting. Now the main power switch is on. Walk around the exterior of the locomotive and turn on for the, the UK routes. Lights. Even for what we had for um uh for Tees Valley, to be honest. Great. Climb back aboard the locomotive and sit down in the driver's seat. Oh, please, can I? Incompetent me in charge. <laughs> do you want me to do the 33 and 52s? Okay, we'll do them. Get them out of the way. Um, yeah, I'll probably go to half 12. I may be regretting this in the morning. Cool dear. To start the locomotive, hold the master key in the start position for at least five seconds. One, two, three, four, five. It does sound a bit quiet With because I've got the volume running, on seventy five percent. The reverser lever determines the direction of travel. Set this into the fourth. Move the parking brake handle into the release position. That's a, this is a nice animation as well. Finally, to get going, set the throttle into position one for at least five seconds, and then set it to position two. One, two, three, four, five. is on the move. To maintain a specific speed, set the throttle back to the off position. To bring the locomotive to a gentle stop, set the driver's brake to the service 30% position. Take this basic training and apply it to further operations, and you'll do great. Yay! Nice little speed curve there. Get a hundred XP. Whoa! Look at that. Eh? Your date's weird. Why is your date's pass pause? Press pause one second. Oh, your dates are weird. Um, yeah, I, I think they are. Um, main menu. So we'll do the thirty one and the 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 oh eight, no, the um thirty three and the fifty two. You said two thousand. Yeah, I think that's what they're set in basically. Oh, it won't be in there, will it? It's in training manuals. Thirty-three introduction, then shall we uh, get on with that one? And then we'll do the fifty-two, and then that'll be it. I call it a night. So next Tuesday, I will open up the the server for um, what I drive next on for Thursday. Um, and what I'll do, I'll take the list, and instead of doing it through, if there's more than five, I'll do some from that list. Oh, six five fifteen.
Welcome to this Class 33 diesel-electric locomotive in British Rail Green Livery. This brief introduction will go through start-up, stopping and passenger door operations. A lot of time will be spent in the locomotive cab, so hey. climb aboard to get started. That's your eyesight. Hope you're not feeling too sick. What does it say on mine? Doesn't say anything on there. To get the locomotive started, set the battery isolation switch. When ready, sit in the driver's seat. Come on then. The master key is used to activate the control desk. <sighs> The locomotive is now ready to be started. Release the brakes and allow the system to charge. Oh, that's cool, Barry, yeah. Use the reverser to set the direction of travel. Headlights are used to inform others around that this train is active. Couldn't do this Give last time. Give a quick time. glance at the platform to ensure all is safe, then unlock the doors. Okay, I haven't. I have class forty three hours and how you doing? Come on, passengers, hurry up. No, I won't do that. I won't do it. I won't let me do it. Okay. I'll let you know in the Discord server how I get on with the test tomorrow afternoon. But this will be after I get the video that needs to be done Boarding for Wednesday is now sorted. Set the doors to locked. With the startup procedure complete, release the parking brake. Increase the throttle to start moving. And of course, they're dual controls because you can run them from the left or right hand side. Coasting is used to maintain a constant speed and be fuel efficient. Climbing or falling grades can affect this, however, so always be vigilant. We got Lieutenant Jenny, look. 33012 from Swanage. Oh, 
I've just got to basically make sure that on the road doesn't make me motion sickness, give me some motion sickness. Because I suffer from many air disease. Um, some games will um, cause me uh, to uh, get that's motion all sickness. There is to it. Pretty simple. And I had a test on on the road on Thursday night after my stream, and it made me feel a bit sick. So it's no good me having on the road and trying to stream it if I'm just going to make myself throw up. So, yeah. Good work. That's the basics covered. A manual can also be obtained that provides more detail about the full functionality of this locomotive. But we won't tell you where you can get that too. Yay! 33 straight out of Compton. I think it is actually straight out of Crompton, isn't it? Hold on. Yeah, straight out of Comp Crompton. Excellent. Blue screen, by the way. Right, so we're back now with the Class 52. Get that out of the way. Ah, oh, it's a great picture, that 37. Oh, I know what I haven't done. I've got all of my tablets as well. I'll watch a couple of episodes of Picard tonight, I reckon. Right, one more. I believe it's the class 52 getting that done. I find the Train Sim World 20, uh, Train Sim World 2 controls a lot better than Train Sim World 2020 controls. Class 52 introduction. Again, this one changes as well. D1062. Welcome to this Class 52 diesel hydraulic locomotive in maroon livery. This brief introduction will go through the start, <coughs> stop, and passenger procedures. Woohoo! Before getting started, some of the controls must be set in the rear cab. Really? So head over and climb aboard. So, I'm going to do this. Oh, it won't let me do it. Let me see. Can I do eight? No, we'll have to do it from the... We'll have to do it from the um, inside. So, yeah, we're getting... Um, to allow fuel to flow to the engines, the fuel transfer pump isolating switch must be set. Who knew that? I didn't. There are two engines in this locomotive, and each one must be activated. A handbrake is located in each cab, and they both need to be released before moving. Everything's now set in the rear cab, so head to the front cab and continue preparations. Excellent. Continue the startup process by setting the battery isolation switch. Oh, they're here. Okay. As in the rear cab, 
set the fuel and isolation switches. A lot of time will be spent in the driver's seat. Take a seat to continue. That's it, uh, AWS stuff down there. The master key is used to activate the control desk. I'll see you later, but then take it easy. Yeah, this would be the last one for me tonight. I'm pretty tired now. Um... Set the reverser in preparation to start the engines. This locomotive features two separate engines that are started independently. Start with the first engine. Now that the first engine is running, start the second one. So I suppose you could still. Headlights are important in letting others around know I that a locomotive is operational. I suppose you could actually start on. Um... You could start on. You could only use one engine. So to get to there, just basically scroll down there. Give a quick glance at the platform to ensure all is safe, then unlock the doors. We won't let you do the AWS, which is a bit of a pain. I said that. Should be able to. Maybe not. I wonder if on this 52 that's coming in for the Great Western Express whether they'll have the um, classification light, the cracked head code there where you can change it. That'd be awesome if they did. It's time to get going. Set the doors to locked. Charge the brake system. Set the brake control appropriately. With the startup procedure complete, release the remaining brakes. Yeah, it'd be nice though to do it. I mean, they've done it with a 33.
increase the throttle to start moving. Do not apply too much power too quickly. Are you joking? With the train now moving, it's possible to apply more power, and focus can be diverted towards achieving a desired speed. Coasting is a method used on flat gradients to efficiently maintain a constant speed and reduce engine stress and maintenance. On the approach to Donifold Holt, start applying a small amount of brake force to achieve a comfortable stop. I think I have to go there. Oops, going a bit too far. No, not that one, you donut. This round here will got to stop, isn't it? Brakes are a bit crap. As before, unlock the doors to allow access to the train for any passengers wishing to board or alight. I think they're not going to come because I think they see my my um, my driving. Right, um, well, this will be it for tonight. I'll just let this load up and finish loading. There we go. Good work. That concludes all the basics of this locomotive.
Oh, class 52. So we've had a few trophies today. And we got a silver. Oh, dear. Excellent. Right then. Thank you all very much, people. I've enjoyed this stream. It's really good. Ooh, preparation work could well be done on Thursday, but we'll see. But for now, it's the main menu and OZ99 to depot. Thanks, everyone, for watching, tuning in. It's been appreciated. Keep an eye out for the new video that's released this Wednesday. Also, the update. The patch update for southeast high speed plus other bits as well as news on the um uh as well as news on the upcoming great western class great western br blue pack that they're doing so yes guys thank you all very much really appreciate it and i shall see you don't forget to like and subscribe to the uh channel and press the old bell icon so if you're interested you'd like to support the channel click the old paypal.me forward slash hentis d6569 link that'll be, you know you can donate any amount of money all that money will come to me any money that's put through the donation of uh, with google with a little dollar sign next to the smiley face i get a percentage of it which i think is really annoying but there you go um yeah so you can either do a super sticker or a super super chat show your support for the channel but thank you all very much guys it's really been appreciated i will see you on thursday night and it will be discord members choose the routes but i will be choosing them at randomly out of the the routes that appear so think about what you want me to what route you want me to drive on but anyway yes guys thank you all very much bit appreciated uh i'm glad you've chosen to you decided to choose your sunday saturday night even yeah saturday night with me so yeah see you on thursday guys have a lovely couple of days and i'll see you later